um, <laughs> we're about to go to Miami, which is an hour from here, to do some shrimping. Never done it before. Never seen shrimp in the wild before. All I know is they like full moons. We got one here. And I got my buddy coming with me that's done it before. So, hopefully we'll be successful. We in Miami, Shrimp. There's a lot of them. Still, the wind and the current keeping us in one spot, which is awesome. So it won't be for long. We've got quite a few people out tonight. I don't know if you guys can see that in the background, but the word is out. The shrimp are floating. The charter boats are being vicious out here. Yeah, man. A couple of people <laughs> trying to run us over. A couple of people trying to us over, <laughs> cussing at us. Started off rough, but we found a nice little cut. I'm sure you guys know where we're at. But they are just going off tonight, folks. It shouldn't take us too long to get our limit. Was it everything I told you or no? Bro, and then some. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, man. And then some. The man the car. He said he needed some shrimp. I said, I knew where they were at. Oh. 
My boy. We all eating tonight. Or not. <laughs> we are officially done here. My boy Gil put me on. This is the results. Back at the house. It's like four o'clock in the morning. But we got it done. Alright, so it's the next day. He's been on ice. So I tried peeling them. The super fresh, they were still alive, and the meat gets stuck to the shell. Like it was almost impossible. I had to cook them with the shell on and then peel them. So yeah. They've been on ice. They've been a lot easier to peel. I've done a couple already. What's up, Mako? What you doing, boy? So, yeah. Um, what was I saying? So, yeah. Put them on ice. And they're so much easier to peel the next day. You're going to want to pinch the head. Let me do it right here. Because it's going to go in the bag. Pinch the head. Boom. That's out. And then I'm trying to do this with one hand. Peels. Here, let me see. Peel some of that shell back. The front shell. Get underneath of it. And then you're just gonna pinch it from the tail, and it comes out smooth. Boom. See that? It's the whole shell. Either in the trash or. For instance, in the bag, because I'm going to make a soup out of this. Alright. Got our shrimp here. Coconut. Breadcrumbs. Flour. Oil. We're obviously making coconut shrimp. <laughs> Alright, so let's see here. So you want to take your coconut flakes? Put them all in there. A uh, little bit of breadcrumbs. A little bit of flour. That all together. You want the majority of it to be coconut flakes. So, got that. Now I gotta butterfly these shrimp and clean the veins out of them. So, fold them like that. Slice them down. Boom, just like that. Put them, actually, right there for now. Take an egg. Pat that out. Push that up real quick. Oh, while this is going, or while I'm about to make these, might as well get the oil hot. Alright, once that's all whisked up, just throw them in there. Mix those around, I'll leave that in there. 
Here. And just take one wet hand, boom, and one dry hand. I'm telling you that will help. <laughs> And that's how they should look. Coconut flakes, you know, majority of the coconut flakes, a little bit of flour and breadcrumb. So, yeah. All right, fast forward to the finishing them all, and that's what you want. That's what they should look like. And so, gonna take some of them. Um, got it on six, medium heat. And just start putting these bad boys in. Well, there you have it, folks. Coconut shrimp with Thai chili sauce. Straight from South Florida. Fresh. <laughs>